Hey beautiful, it's Darby and welcome to my channel. Today I'm telling you guys all my current obsessions. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get right into it. So a major obsession, number one, is gonna be some sunnies. So this is by the brand Firmu and oh my gosh, let's talk about the packaging first. When they sent these, I was like, yes girl, you nailed it. It's a world map on them and then you open it up and guys, how cute are these? Usually I would just go for the typical aviators, but I wanted to try something different. I wanted to try something a little bit more like risque. <laughs> so how cute are these? They are so me with the black and then the gold trim around the lenses and down the side. They are such good quality guys. Like. And they're light, which is awesome because if sunglasses are too heavy, they'll sit on my nose right here and it'll give my nose like the biggest pain and give me like the biggest headache. So they're really light, but they are good quality. And guys, best part, drum roll please. They are giving all my subscribers a free pair of either sunglasses or like reading glasses. So this will include the frame and just standard lenses and then it will come with the case and then it will come with this like cleaning cloth and then it will also come with just a cloth bag for them. So. If you wanted to get a free pair of sunglasses or some frames for some reading glasses, then I'll leave the link down below in the description bar. Like, how amazing is this, guys? I really hope you take advantage of this coupon code. And yeah, that doesn't include the shipping, but whatever, shipping's not that expensive. These are so dope. Oh, and these sunglasses also come with purple lenses. Like, I'm definitely getting those next time. They are so dope, but for now, these are so cool because they'll go with every single one of my outfits. They are so bug eye and just so different and cool. I'm so obsessed with them. So thank you for a move for giving all my subscribers some free sunnies or free eyewear. I'm so obsessed with these. So that is obsession number one. Major obsession number two is going to be a tanning product. So you guys know that I've used this Saint Tropez tanner for years and years, and I feel like I'm cheating on it when I say this, but at least it's in the Saint Tropez family still. So this is my new baby, my new obsession. This is the Saint Tropez one hour tan. So you can either put it on for one hour for light, two hours to be medium, three hours to be dark, or you can pull a Darby and leave it on all night long. Just make sure that you have long pants, socks on, make sure you have a long sleeve, pretty much like a turtleneck, a hat, like don't let your body touch your sheets or else it will totally rub off. And then in the morning just shower and no matter what, shower after your amount of time because it will come like seeping off your body and then you're gonna be left with a beautiful tan. So this is day number five five or six for of my tan and it still looks amazing. It's not streaky, it applied so beautiful, it is so dark. So if you're kind of experienced tanner and you wanna take it to the next level and get something a little bit more darker, go for this one. Otherwise, go for this one if you just want a light tan. But I feel like this one kind of gets streakier and gets like, a little bit faded and rumps off in areas after a couple days and so far this one's been like a miracle. I've showered every single day and I've done hot yoga with it and it still hasn't budged. So new obsession, if you are a fake tan lover and you haven't tried this one already, you need this in your life. So this is for those of you looking for a new foundation and like, come on, when are we not looking for a new foundation? I feel like I'm always looking for like the next best foundation that will look like nice and natural on my skin and like lighter and feel good. So I definitely found that. This is my new obsession, my new baby. This is the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Glow Foundation in shade 205. Looks a little something like this. And yeah, I'm obsessed with it. It's really, really light on the skin, but it covers up all your flaws. The shade is perfect for me. I feel like I could just throw a little bit of this for like a no makeup makeup look and feel like really, really comfortable with my skin. So it has quite a bit of product in here. It is $14 at Walmart, so that's probably the cheapest it's probably gonna get. So it's medium range foundation, but I think it's totally worth it. The rave on YouTube and social media is definitely right. It's definitely worth it. If you're looking for a new glowy foundation, which is funny because usually there's 
like I'd go for the matte foundation, which they have like a matte one and a glowy one in the same packaging. And usually I'd go for the matte one, but I went for the glowy one because everyone's saying that that one is like the bomb. And it's funny how it works because in high school when I used to have more like dewy, like oily skin, matte was in and now that like glowy's in i ruined my skin with using so many products to dry it out and i have dry skin and now dewy skin's in it's just funny how that works but anyway guys this one is definitely worth the hype you should definitely check this out it is my new current obsession so talking about glowy skin, I want to show you guys this product that I've been using for a couple months now. It is by the brand Sephora and it's called the Perfection Mist Nude Glow. So what you do, shake it up and it's a spray and I spray it on my cheeks up here, just on where I put like my highlight and it gives kind of like an oily, dewy effect. So if you're looking for the dewiest skin possible like you can tell that my skin's like really really dewy right now it's because of this baby it feels to the touch not too oily actually right when you apply it you're like oh my gosh it feels like it's dripping down my skin but don't worry it just needs time to like seep into your skin but it leaves the skin so fresh so dewy so beachy so glowy and i'm really really obsessed with this the littlest amount goes the longest way i just put it on the high points on my cheeks or else you'd look maybe a little bit too greasy but if you're in sephora definitely give this a try like spray it on the back of your hand or spray it on your cheeks and see if you like the formula so my next obsession is literally just a bar of soap. Um, so if you watch Desi Perkins here on YouTube, which you have to because she is life, I love her. I love Desi. So she did a video on soap brows. So I wanted to just show you guys this little trick if you haven't heard about it because it's a damn good trick. So if you love doing your brows and you want your brows to stay in place throughout the day, a cheaper alternative, like a way cheaper, way better alternative than getting brow gel, which runs out so fast and doesn't work that well, is to just simply buy a bar of soap and then you'll need a spoolie brush. So what you're gonna do is make sure you get um, a clear bar of soap so that you don't have like color through your brows. And what you're gonna do, well, I guess I'm not gonna pretend like I don't do this and pretend like I go to the bathroom and wet it. What I actually do is just spit on my finger, rub it into the bar of soap, and then I just run my spoolie brush through it. And then I just run the spoolie brush through my hair in little strokes, form them how I want to, and then it will dry within seconds and you'll have locked down brows. They won't budge anywhere. And this is such a cheaper alternative than buying um, brow gel. This bar will last you throughout a lifetime, so you won't have to replace it. This is probably the cheapest brow gel in the whole world, and your brows will be locked down forever and ever. So I think this is my final obsession of the last couple of weeks or so, and it's these shoes. So I was debating throwing these in here or not. I just want you to inspire you guys a little bit to add a little bit more color into your wardrobe, especially for spring. So usually I don't follow the seasonal trends, but this year I did want to add a little bit more pastels and a little bit more color into my spring wardrobe because it is fun and it's it's just a good way and a good excuse to wear like bright shoes or something and it be fashionable. So I got these shoes from Call It Spring or Spring or whatever you call it. <laughs> and I'm in love with them. They have a ruffle on the trim of the shoe. They lace up at the back here, they're open toe and they're just really, really cute. So I'm pretty much just showing you guys these shoes to give you a little bit more inspiration and maybe motivate you or dare you to try to add some color into your wardrobe if you're like me and pretty much only wear neutral clothes. So I hope this inspires you to try something different and step out of your comfort zone. So pretty much that's what I've been obsessed with over the last a little while. I know it wasn't a lot, but they're definitely good products that I wanted to tell you about in some sort of video. So if you guys did want to get free sunnies or eyewear, which why wouldn't you, then go click the link down in my description bar for a free pair. Thank you so much Fermo for giving all my subscribers free sunnies and eyewear. And if you guys did like this video, make sure to give it a like. And if you're not subscribed to my channel already and you want to be notified each time I post a video then hit that subscribe button down below thank you guys so much for watching as always love you so much for watching and we'll see you next time